You'll notice on our model how this facade and this facade are a little bit out of alignment with each other. It kind of violates our grid a little bit, but I'm going to continue on doing that. Um, it seems like it's probably stepped forward another uh, four feet or so, but it's on the second bay in. So if we were to look at level five, you can see it's got that offset to it. So we're going to do the same thing. So um, we're at level four right now in our model. So I'm going to just close that off and open up level five. And I got to go back to that drawing. So we get, I'm going to pick level five. I'm drawing on the right level. All right, so that curtain wall is going across here, stepped out about four feet. So I'm going to go wall, architectural, or curtain wall. We're going to go from level five up. And the trick here now is to see I have a I have three foot indicated, so I know I can draw exactly three feet. So I'll just draw that over and then I'll just move it out. So I'm going to just hit it and hit the space bar because I know it's drawn backwards. And then I'm going to move it out a foot. Just so we're con consistent with our um, kind of modulation. And it looks like we need to pull this wall out a little bit. And that's going to kind of affect us down below. If we were to go to level four, now you know I made that curtain wall a little bit smaller there. We have that overlap. So I'm going to pull this back. Let's take a look at what we've drawn. Okay, so now we need a little piece of wall over here, but it's got to come down and clear on that edge. So let's go back to level five and draw a piece of wall. So I'm going to grab the wall tool, architectural. This time we're going to use the tiled wall. We're at level five. We want to go up to the top of the wall. I'll start in the corner and I'll pull out. And remember, we want to go about two feet past. So if we were right at the center, it's 64. So we really want to go to 66. And if we look at the 3D view, there's some kind of a conflict here. Let me just clear this warning. And I'm not exactly sure why that is. Um, and I don't think it really affects things here. So we've got some overlap. I'm not sure actually what's happening is we have level five up to the top of the wall, which is fine. We want that two foot offset. So we're matching consistently around. Oh, and this one was two foot offset also. So actually what we could do to correct that error is that the base offset for that wall could be two foot also. So that really got rid of that error. All right, so we actually need a floor deck, and we'll do that in the next clip. We need a floor deck and a roof deck for this, and um, we need a couple of other features to add to our model. And I know it was kind of difficult to follow along with all of these changes. I hope um, I hope you can see though the kind of cool um, kind of effects you can start to create um, by modulating these surfaces and combining materials. So let's look at the floors next.